In this video, we will try to understand how to calculate the beam reaction in case of simply supported beam carrying uniformly distributed load of 10 kN per meter over a length of 5 meter and a moment, external moment of 25 kN per meter as well as having the overhang on the right hand side. So let us see the arrangement for the beam in the given particular problem. So as shown over here, we are having the uniformly distributed load and a external moment of 25 kN per meter and we have to find out the reactions Ra and Rb. The total span length will be 1 plus 1 that is 2 plus 3 that is 5 plus 2 that is 7 meter and this particular 10 kN per meter uniformly distributed load is acting over a length of 5 meter. So we know that the meaning of uniformly distributed load is for 1 meter length the load that is acting is 10 kN then for 5 meter it will be 10 into 5 that is 50 kN and as it is a rectangular distribution it will act at the center or it will act from the center of the rectangular section. So it will act at 3 plus 2 that is 5 divided by 2 that is 2.5 meter length. So first we will convert this uniformly distributed load into a point load. So as you can see over here 10 into 5 that is 50 kN and it will be acting at the center of this 5 meter length. So this 3 plus 2 that is 5 divided by 2 so it is 2.5 meter length. So we have converted the given particular uniformly distributed load into a point load acting at the center. Now we will apply the conditions of the equilibrium over here. So as we know that the first condition of equilibrium is summation of forces in y direction is equal to 0, upward forces positive and downward forces negative. So Ra and Rb they are acting in the upward direction so they are positive whereas this point load of 50 kN is acting in the downward direction so that is negative. So therefore we can say that Ra plus Rb is equal to 50 kN. Now let us call this as our equation 1. Then summation of moment about A is equal to 0, clockwise positive and anti-clockwise negative. So start with this Rb. The Rb it is acting in the upward direction. So this upward acting arrow will produce anti-clockwise moment about point A. So as it is anti-clockwise moment it is minus Rb and the perpendicular distance between B and A is 3 plus 1 plus 1 that is 5. So minus Rb into 5. Then this 50 kN load will produce clockwise moment about A. So it is going in the clockwise direction towards A. So it will produce clockwise moment. And the perpendicular distance between this point of application and up to A will be 2.5 plus 1 plus 1 that is 4.5. And there is already an external moment of 25 kN but it is acting in the anti-clockwise direction. So that is negative. So 15 to 4.5 minus 25 that is 200 and transfer this minus Rb into 5 term on the other side it will become positive. So therefore Rb will be equal to 200 divided by 5 that is 40 kN. Now we can substitute the value of Rb in equation 1. So from equation 1 we can say that Ra is equal to 50 minus Rb. So Rb is 40 kN. So 50 minus 40 that is 10 kN. So in this way we can find out the reaction in case of a simply supported beam carrying uniformly distributed load and external moment and also having the overhang on the right hand side. Thank you very much for watching.